Picture yourself adrift in a vast expanse of emptiness with the closest sign of life billions of light years away. This isn't a science fiction scenario, it could be our reality. Astronomical findings indicate that the Milky Way galaxy is positioned near the center of an enormous cosmic void. This void, measuring an astonishing 2 billion light years across, challenges some of the core principles of cosmology. Why is this important? Because it might alter our comprehension of the entire universe. The presence of such an immense void prompts deep questions about the Big Bang, galaxy distribution, and the essence of cosmic expansion. If the conventional models of a uniformly populated universe are incorrect, what other assumptions might we need to rethink? Astronomers were astonished to discover the local hole, an enormous void in the universe extending over two billion light years, encircling our galaxy and positioning us near its center. Initially, the concept of such a void was met with skepticism, as the cosmic microwave background, the afterglow of the Big Bang, implied a fairly uniform matter distribution throughout the universe. This uniformity forms the basis of the cosmological principle, which is crucial to our comprehension of the universe. Nevertheless, as observations grew more precise, the proof of this void's existence became irrefutable. Advanced telescopes and surveys have detected a notable absence of galactic clusters and an unusual pattern of galaxy movements in this region, indicating a profound void. Furthermore, Indranil Banak's recent study published in the Monthly Notices of the Royal Astronomical Society, presents a compelling perspective by associating this void with the unresolved issue of the universe's expansion rate known as the Hubble Tension. Observations show that galaxies within this void appear to recede faster than those outside it. This implies that our estimates of the universe's expansion rate may be inaccurate due to our unique position within this vast, empty space. This void, characterized by its lower density, might be causing what Banach refers to as outflows of matter. Here, the gravitational pull from denser surrounding regions could be drawing matter out of the void, thus speeding up the local expansion rate. This concept of gravitational outflows suggests a revolutionary idea that gravity might function differently in the vast stretches of a void compared to more densely populated areas of space. As we grapple with these revelations, a crucial question emerges. Could our location within this void be affecting everything we observe and measure in the universe? This challenges us to rethink not only our place in the cosmos, but also the fundamental principles of cosmology. The discovery of our residence within a colossal void not only adds a fascinating chapter to our cosmic story, but also forces a critical re-evaluation of the Big Bang theory and the standard cosmological model. If the universe's expansion observed differently depending on one's cosmic locality varies so drastically, could the Big Bang be not the singular event we once thought, but more an echo in our vast cosmic void? Indranil Bonnick's work highlights a troubling inconsistency known as the Hubble tension, which refers to differences in the measured expansion rate of the universe when observed locally versus predictions based on the CMB. This tension suggests that conventional models like lambda cold dark matter might be missing critical nuances of cosmic structure. Bonnick proposes that our giant void could significantly influence local measurements of cosmic expansion, suggesting that these measurements might be inflated by the dynamics within the void itself. Furthermore, the introduction of modified Newtonian dynamics as an alternative theory suggests that traditional understanding of gravity may not hold at the cosmic scales influenced by such voids. Mondi posits that the anomalies in galaxy rotation speeds traditionally attributed to dark matter might instead be explained by modifications to Newton's law of gravity at extremely low gravitational fields, like those in a cosmic void. 
This shift in perspective could mean that the structures such as galaxy clusters and even the behavior of dark matter and energy need to be reconsidered. For instance, the massive galaxy cluster El Gordo presents properties too extreme to fit within the standard model predictions, hinting that our understanding of cosmic evolution, especially within voids, may be fundamentally incomplete. So, how does the absence of mass in a cosmic void affect the curvature of space-time as predicted by general relativity? In general relativity, mass warps space-time, dictating how objects move within that space. However, in a void where mass is conspicuously absent, the traditional models of space-time curvature need adjusting. This could lead to new insights into how voids influence the geometry of the universe and possibly hint at mechanisms of space-time that are active only in such extreme conditions. So if the early universe's rapid expansion was supposed to smooth out irregularities, what does the existence of massive voids say about the uniformity of inflationary effects? The concept of cosmological inflation posits that the early universe underwent a rapid expansion that smoothed out any initial irregularities. Yet, the existence of large-scale voids suggests that this smoothing might not have been uniform, leading to significant large-scale structure variations. Exploring these voids more, we delve into the quantum fluctuations in the early universe. These are believed to be the seeds of all cosmic structure. In regions like our void, these fluctuations may have behaved differently, leading to fewer galaxies and less dense matter. Voids can also serve as natural laboratories for studying phenomena like gravitational lensing, where the path of light from distant objects is bent by gravity. The way light bends around and through the void can tell us about the distribution of dark matter and dark energy, which are invisible but account for most of the universe's mass energy content. So are we truly alone, or is our cosmic solitude just part of a larger, more complex cosmic pattern. Scientifically, the void challenges us to rethink our models and theories. Philosophically, it confronts us with deeper questions about our place in the universe. If vast voids are common, it suggests a universe that is not only patchworked with clumps of galaxies and expansive emptiness, but also dynamically varied in a way that cosmology has yet to fully explain. This patchwork raises questions about the uniformity and isotropy of the universe, which are central tenets in cosmology that may need rethinking. Furthermore, the solitude of such vast empty spaces might reflect on the nature of existence itself. In a universe where vast voids separate islands of cosmic activity, the development of life civilization and cultures might be more isolated events than previously thought, challenging our ideas about the universe's habitability and the potential for interstellar communication and travel. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating journey through the vast emptiness of our cosmic neighborhood. As we've explored today, the discovery of immense voids not only challenges our understanding of the universe, but also invites us to rethink fundamental aspects of cosmology and our place within the cosmos.